Hello, welcome back. My name is David Das. Today's video will talk about dividend aristocrat stocks with the lowest payout ratio and why this is important because the payout ratio is a key financial metric to determine the sustainability of a company's dividend program. And I will talk about the dividend aristocrat stocks in a bit. If you have not subscribed to my channel yet, please do so and press the bell icon so you are notified whenever I upload new videos. Watch this video till the end. I will tell you how you can download a free spreadsheet which lists all the dividend aristocrat stocks with the different parameters like the P ratio, the earnings per share, the payout ratios, the industry, the price, the 52 week charts. So you can sort them and you can decide which stock meet your investment criteria. So let's talk about the uh, payout ratio first. By definition, dividend payout ratio is dividend paid divided by net income, or we can say annual dividend per share divided by annual earnings per share. Do not get confused with the dividend yield, which is actually dividend paid divided by the price of the share. Although the dividend yield is important, dividend payout ratio is a better indicator to determine if the company can distribute the dividends consistently in the future. Now let's talk about the dividend aristocrats. Earlier I made a video on dividend aristocrat stocks, how to find the undervalued dividend aristocrat stocks. The link is provided in the description box below. Dividend aristocrat stocks are S&P 500 stocks which have consistently increased their dividends for at least 25 consecutive years. These businesses have done very well in spite of the volatility of the market, such as the 2000 dot-com bubble, the 2007 to 2009 financial crisis, the 2020 COVID pandemic, and the recent higher inflation and the higher interest rates. So these are well-established companies and they have continuously paid and increased their dividends for over 25 consecutive years. That's the reason many investors like investing in dividend aristocrat stocks because of the time-tested durability. I will list five S&P 500 dividend aristocrat stocks with the lowest payout ratios. So I will start with number five and go all the way up to number one. All the data that I'm going to show you today are accurate as of March 18th, 2024. So number five on my list is a company named Chubb with the ticker symbol CB. They are in the financial services sector and its payout ratio is 15.64%. And they have been increasing their dividends for over 31 years. Number four is Brown and Brown with the ticker symbol BRO. They are also in the financial services sector, their payout ratio is 15.57% and they have been increasing their dividends for 30 years. Number three on my list is a company with a ticker symbol ALB. They are in the basic materials sector and its payout ratio is 11.98% and they have been increasing their dividends for 29 consecutive years. Number two on my list is Nucor Corporation with the ticker symbol NUE. They are also in the basic materials sector. The payout ratio for that company is 11.50% and they have been increasing their dividends for 51 consecutive years. 51 consecutive years. And number one on my list is West Pharmaceutical with the ticker symbol WST. They are obviously in the healthcare sector and their payout ratio is 9.77%, and they have increased their dividends for over 31 years. As I mentioned before, I have put together a spreadsheet with all this information, as well as the P ratios, the 52-week the, the charts, the highs and lows, the, uh, the dividend yield, for all the dividend aristocrat stocks, which you can actually download, and you can sort through them, as I mentioned before, for your research purposes. The link is provided in the description box below. And I'm sure it will be highly useful for your, uh, for your research. That's the end of this video. I hope you have enjoyed it. If you found any value in this video, please press the like button. That really helps my channel. Thank you for watching and I will see you in the next time.